I'm Francis. I'm a dad, I'm a teacher, I'm a surfer, I'm a wannabe musician. I've been at Green School for three and a half, going on four years now. Um, I'm very happy. I teach a bit of French. I help with some people with some math. Gentlemen, you were supposed to be back in your office working 40 minutes ago. 4-0. And I boss people around. I chose this challenge design because I'm really passionate about surfing and I also really like the idea of going to the beach and cleaning up after ourselves. My favorite thing about Rise to Surf was actually going surfing and then seeing how we turned the materials that we found in the water on the beach into actual usable things. This is called uh, Rise to Surf Chapter 4, Trash to Cash. And what we want to do is show people that um, the resources that are getting dumped on beaches in Bali and around the world are only trash if they're left there to rot and get into our food supply and destroy our lovely beaches and our enjoyment of them. And uh, hopefully we can get some of that and transform it into something that we can sell. In that way we give the students an opportunity to go through the process of designing and making and testing and mass producing products and, and seeing how to sell and promote things um, at the same time as providing useful uh, service for our community, cleaning up our beach and bringing a bit of awareness to that problem. The most surprising thing for me was how we actually transformed these things that seemed lost, these things that were called trash in other people's eyes and minds and we transform that into amazing resellable products. I want to prove to the world that surfers aren't just beach bums, they're probably the frontline warriors who sit in the trash in the line up thinking how can we change this. But at the moment we're still focusing on getting our kids to understand their responsibilities as ocean users to help solve one of the biggest problems on Bali. So my hope is that if we can get the kids' passion of surfing to develop into their passion for learning, into their passion for saving the environment, that will very soon start to have a strong knock-on effect all over the community. I'm really passionate about surfing and I think I could really give uh, the people in the surf industries with their kind of closed tunnel vision minds something more, something to, so that they can better understand their environments. I want the Groms to grow up thinking, ah, look, it's a piece of trash after I just got barreled. I'm gonna pick it up, put it in my wetsuit or board shorts, whatever, bring it into the beach, and maybe start collecting all of those, and then freaking turn it into something, you know what I mean? I, I hope that in the next couple of years, this program will carry on to develop, and you'll see the impact we have on the world around us, and I hope it will go make ripples, waves all over the world, and we'll join together with other schools and show the world that really it's up to the kids, and the kids have some of the most creative and interesting ideas out there, and together we can change the tide of plastic.